and welcome my viewers. Do you know what is ecosystem? Come let me tell you all about it. An ecosystem is a chain of interaction between living organisms and their surroundings environment. There are two types of ecosystem terrestrial means land-based ecosystem. This is land ecosystem you can see here everyone interact with each other. The another kind of ecosystem is aquatic that is water-based. This is aquatic ecosystem here every living beings, all water animals and water plants are interact with the surrounding environment. Aquatic ecosystem are divided into two types. Freshwater that includes lake, river, ponds and salt water that includes all oceans. In any ecosystems living organisms dependent on each other for food and make a feeding relationship. Now let's study this feeding relationship between living organisms. What are food chains? Food chains are a representation of the flow of energy and feeding relationship from one organism to another in an ecosystem. In a basic food chain, organisms are categorized into different trophic levels based on their position in the chain. First level is producers. Producers are eaten by consumers. Last level is decomposers. I am going to explain all these levels. Producers are organisms that can produce their own food. Most producers get their energy directly from the sun. All the plants are producers as they can make their own food with the help of sun's energy. Consumers are organisms within a food chain that obtain energy and nutrients by feeding on other organisms. All the animals are consumers. They can be categorized into different groups based on their feeding habits and position in the food chain. Types of consumers based on their feeding habits are herbivores, carnivores, omnivores. Now let's study what they are. Herbivores eat plants and fruits. For example giraffe, zebra, cow, goat, rabbits they all are herbivores. Carnivores eat meat and other animals. For example lion, cheetah, shark, eagle, snake, they all are carnivores and they eat other animals. Omnivores eat both plants and animals. Like humans, rats, crows, ants, they all are omnivores. We have discussed all the major components of food chain. Now let's see how all these components built a food chain. Food chains begin with a producer. This is usually a green plant or algae which make their own food with the help of sun's energy. Grass is the producer in this food chain. In the second trophic level, the primary consumer eats the producer. In this food chain, the primary consumer is the grasshopper. In the third trophic level, the secondary consumer feeds off the primary consumer. In this food chain, the secondary consumer is the frog. In the fourth trophic level, the snake is the tertiary consumer. The snake is a predator and the frog is its prey. The animal at the top of the food chain is an apex predator. It is not eaten by another animal. The hawk is also the quaternary consumer and its prey is the snake. A food web is made up of multiple food chains. It shows how they interact. What is a predator and prey? A predator is an animal that hunts, kills, and eats other animals. A prey is an animal that is hunted by another animal for food. Here cheetah is predator as it hunt bull and bull is prey as it is hunted by cheetah. These relationships of prey and predator are essential for maintaining balance in ecosystems and the flow of energy from one organism to another. What are decomposers? Decomposers break down dead plant and animal matter into nutrients that can be used by other organisms. They play a crucial role in the food chain. An organism, often a bacterium, fungus, or invertebrate that feeds on and breaks down dead plant or animal matter, making organic nutrients available to the ecosystem. Types of food chain. Aquatic, water. These food chains occur in aquatic ecosystems such as lakes, rivers, ponds, and oceans involving organisms that live in water. Terrestrial, land. These food chains occur on land and involve organisms that inhabit terrestrial ecosystems such as grasslands, deserts, and forests. This is an example of food chain on land. This is an example of food chain in water. Thanks for watching. Hopefully the video is helpful for you. 
Don't forget to like, share and subscribe. Do comment if you have any query.